The Office of Personnel Management, the director, Catherine Archuleta, is stepping down. It's at the center of one of the largest data breaches right now uh, in U.S. history. More than 21 million people are believed to have had their personal information compromised or outright stolen. And by the way, it's about five times the number that we'd originally heard was the breach. Senior White House correspondent Jim Acosta standing by live with more on this. There were calls for her to step down, but at the time it didn't right. look like there was going to be any movement. And then this. Uh, that's right. House Speaker John Boehner was calling for Catherine Archuleta's resignation yesterday and during a conference call with reporters about that massive data breach uh, that OPM announced. Uh, 21.5 million people, every federal employee that's gone through a background check since 2000. Uh, Catherine Archuleta said on this conference call, actually, that she was not stepping down. But a White House official says uh, in ju just the last few minutes that uh, Catherine Archuleta, the director of the Office of Personnel Management, has uh, tendered her resignation to President Obama. He has accepted that resignation and that uh, that resignation is effective at the end of business uh, today. Uh, starting tomorrow, we're told by a White House official, Beth Colbert, uh, I, I believe it's Beth Colbert, I hope, hope we're pronouncing her name correctly, uh, will assume the role of acting director of the Office of Personnel Management. She is currently the U.S. Chief Performance Officer and Deputy Director of uh, Management uh, at the Office of Management and Budget. So somebody coming out of uh, the Obama White House essentially going over to OPM to run that uh, very troubled uh, organization right now. Actually, uh, we were on this conference call yesterday uh, with OPM, with uh, members of the National Security Council, other top administration officials. Uh, this is a stunning, massive data breach uh, that affects uh, almost every employee of the federal government. And we should point out uh, at this point, OPM said yesterday they do not believe uh, that any of that data has been used uh, for illicit purposes. But of course, OPM did not know the scope of this investigation. So it's really anybody's guess uh, as to whether or not uh, that data has been used improperly. Uh, we have also been he hearing from uh, top officials that China was be uh, behind this big breach. Uh, but as of yet, the White House has not publicly named China as the culprit in that investigation. They say the investigation is ongoing. Uh, but when the head of the DNI, James Clapper, said last week that they're a prime suspect, uh, nobody inside this administration that I've talked to yet has said China is not responsible. So they're not publicly naming them yet, but they're also not denying that the Chinese are probably behind this hack, Ashley. Yeah.